Good morning, everybody. Uh, this is your man Josh here again over at JJ's Classic Shine, or Classic Shine for short. Um, got a, a unique vehicle this morning. We're doing a 4Runner. Um, you know, in the last videos, you saw me doing my mom's vehicle, uh, my vehicle. Um, and now we're going to, you know, we're working on a uh, friend's vehicle. You know, a friend hit me up on Facebook and said, hey, you know, I, I need a wash. You know, I, I like your videos. You know, I see you're doing a good job. Um, you know, can you come do my vehicle? So I had him send, him, send me a couple pictures uh, because I do a waterless wash and wax. Uh, so if you have a vehicle that's extremely dirty, you know, I have a different, you know, system for you. Um, I'm not 100% go on that just yet um, for, you know, the foam washes and stuff like that to, to get off the big caped on dirt, you know, think of off-roading or, you know, massive amounts of, of bird poop, stuff like that. Um, but, you know, just the average stuff, you know, parking your car under a tree, you know, you have sap, stuff like that, uh, dust, you know, just driving back and forth, work, just daily use. And you want your car to shine again, you know, that's that's what I specialize in, you know. I'm water, I'm eco-friendly, you know, so um, for, for you eco-friendly people in Southern California, you know, this is something that tailors towards you guys. Um, but it's also something that's quick, you know, I can come to your job, go to your house, like I'm on the way to his house right now. Um, it's about 9.30, so it's still early. It's not even 80 degrees yet. Um, but yeah, we're just doing a quick wash. We're gonna knock that off, so. Um, here in a second, you know, we're going to cut to, uh, I'll do a quick walk around the car, see exactly what, you know, if he has any specific needs, stuff like that, and then, uh, you know, we'll get some time lapse going. I, I was going to bring my, my helmet mount, my, my, my head cam, as I call it, um, but I, uh, I left that at home, so um, you guys are just going to get to sit on the stand today and uh, watch from a distance, you know, first person view. Maybe, maybe next video I'll, I'll make one uh, first person. So, uh, other than that, hang tight. We're on to the next next adventure. All right, so we're here doing a quick walk around this four runner. It's not too bad. I've seen worse. Uh, got the normal dust layer, well, two layers of dust on it. Got some dirt up here. This will probably be the hardest spot. It's just up top because everything gets baked on. But. Uh, Bird poop, normal stuff. We should be good. We're halfway done with our waterless wash. This is a vehicle that gets a lot of use out of it. I don't know if you can see on the camera, but um, literally I've only done my right side. It would be the left side of the vehicle. Uh, did the top of the, the Forerunner at the roof, or I'm sorry, the hood. But you can see the comparison of how dirty it is over here versus how clean it is over there. And this is all just with the waterless wash and wax. Uh, we had some bugs, you know, these same bugs were on this side and we got 90% of them off. Some of them are literally caked on there, but uh, we'll get those another time with a clay bar. But yeah, so now I just gotta knock out the rest of it. Taking a quick little break cause it's starting to warm up, but uh, we're ready to go. It's turning out pretty all good. Right. Here is the finished product. Uh, with just the chemical guys, waterless wash and wax, the streak free shine. Got it, got it shining a little bit better. You know, this vehicle needs some paint correction. Uh, we need definitely need a, oh, see, this is part of what I'm standing in. Definitely need a clay bar session. Um, it's an off road vehicle, so he, you know, he has to park outside on the street. His brother has a Mustang that he, he takes up the garage, so. He's stuck parking on the street, so that's why uh, we got a lot of tree sap and pollen on the uh, on the Forerunner. But yeah, here's the wash. Shined up really good. So we just finished up Kevin's Forerunner. Uh, he has a 2004 uh, Forerunner. It's lifted. Looks really, really nice. Um, one of the things I, I've learned from this detail, you know, just doing a little quick uh, summary to to this wash. Um, you know, always be prepared. I, I left my ladder um, to get on top of, you know, the Forerunner because it is lifted. I am a tall guy, but I wanted to make sure I was thorough and I could reach. So just found a way to, to make that work. Um, I didn't do the time lapse. I forgot to do the time lapse video, uh, but I kind of just went step by step, you know, kind of getting you guys updated um, on that. So 
but uh, just you know, be prepared. You know, have fun. Um, always, I, I found a shaded spot, you know, for us. But uh, I should have got out of here. I got out here a little earlier. Um, I was supposed to be here at 9:30. I didn't end up leaving until 9:30. But uh, I ran out of shade, you know. So just detailing in the sun, especially with uh, waterless wash and wax, um, the solution dries up really quick. So if you are in the sun it's not a, a good thing it's not like water um, it's eight parts water you know but it's an eight to one mix excuse me but um it's just uh learning you know what works what doesn't work um you know what's the best way to do this best way to do that so other than that thank you kevin thanks for, for letting me uh detail your forerunner uh, tell everybody about it um you know, tell everybody about about my services so you know I, I want to get to you know more more detailed jobs you know washing waxing people's cars um, grow to the next step and, you know do clay bars um, you know that would be my advice for him on the next step once I, I, I get skilled enough to do that you know I'll do clay bar and for him um, because you know his paint can look really really great you know the car cleaned up well the forerunner cleaned up well but in certain spots, you know, you can tell that there's, you know, a lot of stuff caked into the paint, cooked into the paint. So uh, clay barring will, will definitely, definitely help that out. So, um, but other than that, it's the end of today's video, end of today's job. Um, it's about 12 o'clock here, West Coast time. So uh, I'm going to go eat lunch and relax the rest of the day. So you guys have a good one. Hang tight. Uh, for more videos, I'm going to keep you guys up to date on, on new products, new things that I'm doing. Um, and if you guys, you know, if you guys want to get your car washed, you guys need a wash, you need a wax, um, you need me to do it at your job, at the house, you know, wherever you are, um, hit up my Instagram account um, or hit me up on Facebook. So I'll put the links down below um, in the description. You guys have a good one.